about it through some friends. And I remember one friend, he used to always just say he'd love to sit and look at the lake and just what a relaxing place it was, but we didn't know about it. And then some friends um, of ours, we were talking about it and we all decided we'd go ahead and go. I guess my first impression was it was just really dark. We were lost trying to find this cabin where the, our key was for the cabin that we rented, but we just kept getting lost. It was just so dark and wooded. I can still imagine that. That was my first impression. Being in Nojiri was a great place for community. We entered a community because we were the new people. And it just seemed like everyone knew each other. Yeah, it just seemed like it was just a very relaxing place to be together with other families. And it didn't take long for us after, you know, we went a couple of years for us to see familiar faces. And in particular, my wife really likes to socialize and so that was a great place for her and she made friends really quickly. One kind of a microcosm community was the kids community and I think that's what I really appreciated because it was a very safe environment in that the kids could just run around and do whatever they wanted and they could uh, swim or play tennis, hike, and just explore in the woods and uh, yeah we didn't have to worry about them so much. Nojiri is whatever you you want it to be. Some people love all the sporting activities. Some people like, you know, the hiking and all that. For me, I just liked it because it was quiet. In my work, I deal with people all day long. And Nojiri for me is a place for me to relax and uh, kind of be by myself. It was very, very relaxing, helped me to uh, wind down.